Hi everyone, welcome to my art class. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a fish ball. Okay, ready? That's starting it. Alright, today material you will need the paper play and I use pencil to outline and after that I sharpie and we all have a cutout, use scissors and use glue stick to glue and then you also need the color pencils and uh, this one is the scr scratch paper okay so uh, I will show you what to do after and then push pins to for scratching and this is the stick for scratch too all right and additional you will need the white paper to draw all right so the first one, what I'm going to do, I'm going to start to outline the fishbowl from this uh, plate. So first one, I'm going to just, you know, make an oval. I use pencil first because, you know, in, in case if I do wrong, I can still fix it. Use eraser to fix. So first one, I just do a little bit. This way, it's for the small flat oval for the opening part. And then I'm going to do another oval inside. This one, so it looks like, you know, it's the opening part for the rim. Okay, you see like that. And... Um, this one, the outside, you are going to just bring it in a little bit, you know, like here, a little bit difference. Bring it difference. So you see this one line right here, start to connect, 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 connect to here. Did you see? Okay. All right, same thing to this side. I'm going to do it from here. All right. So same thing you see this one right here connect 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 all the way to here all right like that and then here a little bit rounded all right i think i need to fix a little bit here i like here this one this a little bit curvy right here and here I want to do it a little bit perfect like that around there okay and you know sometimes you can put upside down to fix the oval to make sure if it's the way you like it make sure if it's good okay And then I'm going to do it here too. Yeah, I'm going to fix a little bit. I think this will be nice. Okay, I'm going to erase unnecessary line to make it a little bit clean. Not so dirty, okay? A bit clean. It's going to be a white color like that all right and on the bottom i'm going to do a little uh difference too okay so about here around uh here it's the center right a little bit here a little bit here i'm going to make the rim make a little bit difference right here make a little bit difference right here so same thing is why i'm gonna bring it up to make it more rounded okay and then here gonna bring it up make it rounded okay hopefully this one was symmetrical and then on the bottom curve curve all right and then i can just go ahead and make the line Round it, okay. And make it, but make it rounded. I'm gonna put it upside down and fix a little bit because here I don't think it's that 
perfect. A little bit here too. Okay, and I'm going to erase this part. Like that. Like that. Okay. All right, I think I'm all set. So on the next one, make sure it's clean. And I'm going to use my Sharpie. I use the thick Sharpie. And I'm going to start to online make it thicker. So you can see I start to outlining it, make it much thicker. Thicker. A little bit thicker, okay? That's perfect after, okay? And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to online first, draw a line, and then a color block to make it thicker. Like that. fix this part take on the line take on the line yeah make a little bit nice and even I think this rim looks okay right okay yeah a little bit more Right here, this rim looks okay. All right, and then I'm going to do inside. Inside right here. Okay. Again, I'm going to just go ahead and online first. Online first. Okay, and once I online, and I thick it up. Make it thicker. Okay, let's do it together. One, almost there. Color in. Color in. Here we go, like that. Okay, I think right now it's good. Double check. See where you want to add more. Double check. Here and there, okay. Double, double check. All right, next one I'm going to do it right here. So, same thing online, 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 online. Click on the line. You know, I like the paper plate texture. You see like a bumpy bumpy? It looks really nice. Okay. 
Okay, so keep on coloring it to make it a little bit thicker. Right here. And then I'm going to do the other side right here. You can see color in, make it thicker, thicker, color it out a little bit more. I think both sides will do good. All right. So next one, let's do the bottom part. Okay. In the bottom part, I'm going to turn it upside down. Okay. And then start to color this, outline this part. All right. And then again, make it thicker. Thicker out, thicker. And see like that okay and then same thing I'm going to do this side from here to here take on the line thicker thicker take on the line. okay and uh, I think this one, this part, we can start to connecting it. Okay, I just want to make sure, you know, it's nice and even. All right, that's connecting it. Okay, and then thick out the line. Color in, color in. Okay, in the bottom part, we can start to make the curve. I just want to make sure it's in the center. Okay, and then here make the curve. Let's fill it in, make the curve, this part. I think I make it a little bit too high, huh? Okay, maybe here. Okay, here. We can adjust it later, okay? And then thick on the line right here as well. Color in. Color in. Color in. Here we go and then next one I'm going to start to trim okay that's trim trim the plate okay and then you can see here too I'm slowly in the plate cut out the unnecessary part okay and then bottom here cut it out and bottom here too oh here we already did it wonderful like that okay and I think here a little bit too thin I'm going to thick out a little bit more like that okay here we go and I have a fish ball ready okay you can see like that okay and the next one I have this one this one is a scratch paper okay 
it's perfect shape can fit in the middle and then look like a water is inside and then if you don't have uh, if you don't have the uh, this one the shape usually come with the sheets and then you can uh, just go ahead and uh, cut it make sure you know you draw and cut it that even though like this one if you like you know you can use your pencil and then draw like you know have it uh, water inside so what I'm going to do I'm gonna trim a little bit like this paper right here I'm using pencil okay and I want to make an oval right here a little bit I think this is okay actually no nah. this is good flat it's good okay nothing all right forget about that sorry about that part and then we are going to put this one glue let's use glue stick flip over put a lot of glue on this scratch paper okay and stick on the top like that push 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 this one looks good okay and then we can start to push push I want it stays well okay and then we can start to draw a little bit um fish this and that okay and uh, before we do it I like to scratch uh, the sand area so what I'm going to do I'm going to have a uh, use push pin okay push pin and the scratch this one scratcher okay and i'm going to start to make the same area by scratching it like you know just kind of scratch a little bit out you can see the beautiful color already comes out and uh, i'm gonna just do circle like you know look like a sanding area here and there a little bit here and there a little bit can see I put a lot of circles different sizes different size here and there here and there here and there okay and I will start to scratch scratch so you can see some of the beautiful colors start to coming out and but I leave the circle without scratching it you don't need to do it perfect sometimes you know the way you scratch and the texture it looks nice too so you know when you scratch just trying to see how it look alike see if you want to review more color or just um, give it without scratching it so it's really up to you okay so right now i'm just keep on doing it goes around the circle i just did but the way i scratching it you know i didn't scratch out perfectly at least some area still on scratch I want to see if it looks good that way okay so keep on working here and there okay here and there I think this one scratching part is so fun to do it no. and then we'll, you see the reflection right okay 
and then I can turn a little bit different uh, side so you can see that reflection from the camera. Like that. Okay, I'm gonna clean a little bit. You see, can you look like that? It looks nice, huh? But I'm gonna scratch a little bit more around the circle, just a little bit around the circle. I want the circle review a little bit more clean, only around the circles, because I really want this, um, those circles, those kind of shapes stands out a little bit more. But other area, I'm not worried about it. I like the texture. Okay. And right now, I just scratch, scratch. Okay, around it. More. I want the circle reveal. Shows up more. Shows up more right here. Show up more. Here and there. Especially around the circles, okay? I think right now it's perfect. Oh, one more right here, I can see. Okay, okay, look good. Later on, I show you a different view, and then you can see better. Okay, without that much reflection. Okay, and then next one, we can do water. Okay, uh, but the water, I, I want to wait a little bit. I want to uh, start working on the fish and sticky on and then maybe do water after but it's really up to you okay and when i say water you know it's it's like you know you can just scratch you know scratch out some of the line and then make it a little bit wavy like that you see wavy so that looks nice okay wavy here and there you can scratch a lot and then you can scratch any way you like it okay have fun okay have fun and then you can even do bubbles after okay okay that's how it looks so far and you can use the push pin too you do a smaller stroke if you like that's nice too all right like that like that okay okay here we go all right of course you can scratch out more if you like okay but right now next one i want to working on the fish and then you know uh, some other stuff okay so have a sharpie ready you can use pencil i use sharpie okay and let's draw a small castle okay and the castle is very very easy let's do a a beautiful one okay so for the younger kids you shape 
remember rectangle square can make a castle that's make it much easier okay so what i'm going to show it to you okay so right now first make a rectangle don't do it too big okay rectangle and then make the door you can make the door and then here can overlapping a little bit so it looks like a 3D, right? Okay, and then you do castle line, line up here, line here, and then you do castle line, up, down, up, down, up, down, like that, we call castle line. Like that, okay? And then you're gonna build up a little bit higher so this one it's gonna be a long rectangle right here you are a little bit okay my goes down i do it slow okay so you can follow me close up let's do the other side too a little bit even my goes down close up okay and then here let's do a little bit skinny rectangle same thing to this side skinny rectangle okay and then on the top we do castle line too okay line line i'm gonna do two dash one two castle line like that you see okay all right line line one two Kiss on my, kiss on my, like that. And then here, we can make another uh, shorter rectangle. Shorter. It's just keep on building it, okay? And then we can do the triangle on the top. Triangle. Together. And we can do flag. It's gonna be fun like that. Flag. All right. And then we can right now we can do a little bit textures. For example, here brick. A little bit here. A little bit here. Just kind of you know texture around here and there. Brick brick okay even though here too you can have some fun and doing like you know textures like that okay all right and if you like you can even add the uh, sand a little bit like that And then tap dot 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 just like that and then you are done okay and then this one we are going to color all right any color you like you see i have lots of color pencil color and you know maybe a orange 10 okay i do it really fast okay gonna color color in and then later on we cut out and and uh, glue it on, okay? So I just do everywhere. This castle, wrong color, 10, I will say 10. Everywhere. Okay, for the flag. I like to add a little bit pole for the black and then the red color for the flag. Okay, and then maybe castle right here overlapping with a little bit red. A little bit red. A little bit red and then 
inside here, darker brown, here darker brown. And add a little bit orange for this area. Okay, and I'm going to do orange on the side a little bit, on the side a little bit, underneath here a little bit. And then I'm going to add a little bit on the side here, on the bottom here, on the side, on the bottom, on the side. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit red for the brick. For the brick. And then for here, I do a little bit of um, shading on the bottom. Okay, and I have a brown shading a little bit more on the bottom and on the corner. Okay, and I'm going to do much harder on um, inside right here. A little bit harder okay and then I'm going to add a little bit yellow on the sand make it a little bit yellowish and then add a little bit yellow for the castle line area okay and if you like you can keep on playing you know any color you like I'm gonna add a little bit Darkest blue for here. I want it to look a little bit darker. This darkest blue. And then on the bottom of the sand, a little bit darker too. Okay. And then inside. I want it a little bit darker. Like that. Underneath, underneath. Have fun, okay? Have fun, alright? Alright. I think that this is good. Okay, I'm going to draw uh, seaweed. Okay, seaweed is so easy. You can do like, you know, uh, seaweed and coral. Okay, and just kind of curve and up and down, curve up and down like that. Very easy, right? And then just dot, 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 dot. Okay, and then same thing, keep on going. Any kind of shape, feel free. Just go up and down, up and down, oval shape. And then da 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 da. Okay, and I'm going to create a little bit CV. So, what I'm going to do, just make a line, goes up. And then around this line, you go up, down, up, down, up, down, like that. So you see, become a seaweed or a plane, you know, like that. And then put a little bit textures over there. Okay, I'm going to create a little bit behind. Smaller one. Okay, and then here too, mm, right here, like that, so another one right here, so this, when I do this, it prevents seaweed, you know, cutting too much, like a too much hard line to cut, okay? Line, 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 and maybe a little bit here too. Line goes out, then go up and down, up and down, and da 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 da. 
just like that okay that's color okay I'm going to pick the light green I like the light green color in color in color in I cut the ink, cut the ink. And then I want to add a little bit yellow. For example, these two, maybe add a little bit yellow on the one in the front. A little bit more yellowish. And then one, two, in the middle one, a little bit yellowish. Just want to separate the color. Okay, and I need the darker screen. Darker screen right here. Uh, I'm gonna do on the bottom overlapping area a little bit thicker middle line a little bit thicker okay and the middle line here middle line here middle line here like that okay and then girl I can use pink I like pink I like pink, so let's use pink. Pink, pink, pink. Okay, I'm going to add a little bit red. On the back, that one a little bit darker, and then some on the bottom, this coral too. Like that. Okay. And then a little bit purple-ish. I think this is good, okay? All right. Uh, seaweed, queso, and we need fish. All right. Here we go. Let's have a fish. So keep on drawing any kind of fish you like. Okay, I'm going to draw, you know, small, small, so very small fish. Okay, so let's see an oval and do the tail, and then we can make a curve. And then two stripe one, two, make the eye. Okay, and then fin, a little fin, fin, little fin. You see? Fish is good. Okay, it's done. Okay, so let's make another small fish. In this one fish, I'm going to make it a little bit. Uh, rounded okay uh, a little bit rounded like that a little bit rounded okay and the tail split and we make some line okay make a curve make that and then I do a little scale you can do it too. Okay, and then fin. Fin the other one too. Okay, yeah, I got two fishes, right? You see, like that. And then how about one more? I think one more, that's it. We will have enough fish, okay? So another one, we can make it a little bit um, pop. 
puff, okay, a little bit puff. Mm, okay, a little bit puff, maybe like that. Pointy a little bit, maybe. A little bit longer. Curve up, curve down. Like that. And then make some lines. And then curve, make that. Okay. And fin. Line, line, line. Fin. Line, line, line. And a little bit lines like that. Okay, I think I have three fishes, it's good. Okay, let's color. I have my color pencil. I like the orange. Orange right here. Orange right here. Okay, a little bit orange right here. Now do any color you like, okay? And a little bit yellow. Yellow, yellow, yellow. A little bit tan. I want to feel a little bit darker. Like that. Okay, and this one I want to make it a little bit gray. If I have a yeah, let's find the black. I want it a little bit gray. Okay, here, tail. I use black, okay, but I do it really light so it looks like it's gray. And the thing, I push a little bit harder so it looks darker. And the texture line here, I do it a little bit darker too. And the line right here is too. So, like that. All right, and then this one, ooh, rainbow color. Any color you like, okay? I do a little bit teal here and there because I like this color. And I do a little bit pink here and there, purple. Here and there, it's rainbow fish. And I do a little bit yellow here and there. I make the rainbow fish easy. Okay. All right, pencil, let's put it away. Start to cut it out. I think I have a enough. So before we start, I'll always cut it smaller pieces. Smaller pieces. Because this this way easy for me to cut. I don't need to hold a huge paper and it goes around, right? Okay. So first one, this fish. Cut it out. This project, I like it. Um, you have fun and then you also do a little bit drawing. That's why I like it. Okay. So cut it a little bit closer. And then later on when we've done all the cutting, we can arrange it and then you can see where you like it to put it on, on your fish ball. It will look really nice, okay? Small, huh? All right, and one fish. Okay, my rainbow fish right here. A little bit. Some students like to do fish a little bit bigger. That is okay too. Up to you. And then some of the students like to create some more fish. You know, your fish tank up lots and lots of beautiful fish. Fishes. That's good. Be creative, okay? Last part. Here we go. All right, and other one right here. And then you know, 
if you like the drawing you can always add something else like textures and you know dots lines anything anything you like drawing is fun create it's fun too all right follow my cut it out little by little okay little by little i have a three already okay castle cut it around this castle should be easy to cut okay and don't worry about that castle one, just cut it straight. Close it around. Close it around and cut. Yeah, and then on the line. Okay. around it here we go all right and a little bit on this part this part Here, cut it around. Cut it around. Kiss on line. Be patient. All right. It will be fine. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Almost there, okay? Just a little bit. Practice, practice your scissors. You can come more detailed. Okay? It's good for you. Keep going. Keep going. All you need to do is follow the shape and turn your paper in and out, in and out. Like that. Okay, here we go. Out, in, out, in, out, in, out. Like that. In coordination, okay. I know it's a little bit too much for the younger friend, but it's good, you know, you learn your hand coordination. Right? Almost there. And then we can arrange how to 
place it on your fish tank. Here we go. Okay, we have those subjects right now ready to glue. See this one is my fish off and then castle where you like to put right here or right here it's up to you I, I like it this way okay so let me put glue put glue on the back okay and then stick it on any way you like it. I think I'm gonna stick it on like here, right here, like that. Stick it on. You see, like this, okay? And I'm going to glue the curl, okay? And the seaweed, cut it. Glue, glue, put lots of glue. Ha! This fish, hold on. Wait for your turn. Okay, right now it's gonna be right here. Glue it on. Like this. Hey, hey. Next, next. And then you can arrange your fish, see where. They, you like it like this one this one maybe this one right here yep I like that way okay I'm gonna pick it up put some glue all right and then swing right here okay and this one pick it up Put some glue. So much fun. Right here. Okay, and this one. Pick it up, flip. Put some glue. How about here? Or, you know, hiding, hiding, uh, or hiding like a Beneath, you can just pick up a little bit these, and then you can let it hide. Right now, a little bit hard to ah, too hard to take it off. Anyway, you can put the fish, you know, behind the seaweed. That's fine too. Okay, look at that. Ooh, and then I want to make some bubbles. Okay, so I'm going to scratch. Use push pin. Scratch out some of the beautiful color and make bubble, colorful bubble. Okay, I have a tool, scratch tool. Okay, if you don't have it, you can use push pin, okay? Bubble, bubble. Scratch, scratch. That's fun, okay. Okay, hold on. And I'm going to scratch a little bit from here. Scratch a little bit too, and then scratch a little bit here too. Okay, and then if you like, you know, you can keep on scratching some more water. Some more water. The more you scratch, the more colorful color it comes out. Okay, so really have fun scratching it. 
see how you like it sometimes a little bit pointy the line is thinner okay and if you use the stick you know the line can be thicker so depends on what kind of outcome you like it so you can just go ahead and do it here and there here and there okay have fun all right i'm going to show you a little bit how you look alike okay let me switch camera ready Ta -ta -da! this is the outcome fishy 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 kum, 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 kum. Kum, kum, kum. that's the project for today and i hope you like it Enjoy the lesson and I see you next time. Okay. All right. Bye bye, everyone. See you next time. Bye bye. Bye. Bye.